everyone welcome back once again my name is Dalat Hussain in this video I'm going to show you that how you can create an email subscription form in Send in Blue. so whenever you run your campaign as per your target audience it's become very handy and it's actually very easy to create that email subscription form in Send in Blue. so to create that form just simply click on this contact and as you can see here we get the option to create our form as you can see I have already a bunch of email IDs as per my target audience I'm going to run an email marketing campaign on muscle gain diet where I will be offering free diet book for muscle gain and according to that I'm going to create my subscription form my ebook my email automation that's all going to be connected with each other so make sure that you should watch all the videos all these series of video where I would be teaching you that how you can target your audience as per your target audience that's all you're going to find out so to create a form all you have to do is simply click on this form and as you can see this is my main account and at this moment two automation is already running from this account so this is the emails this is the form which I have created for those automation so in this video I'm going to teach you that how you can create it for scratch so to create a new subscription form we have to simply click on create a new subscription form and here we have to design our subscription form and we have to create our subscription form so before I start creating I would like to tell you that why we create subscription form and why we have so many subscription form in our email marketing software so when you create your email subscription form what you do you offer something if you run a lead magnet or you give a free ebook with a specific target audience so the form we were going to design in this campaign will keep that in mind that we're going to target target a specific audience with this form and here i'm going to target those people who have interest in muscle gain diet so this form is going to design in that way because my target audience is interested in muscle gain diet so i'm going to give the name exact that same so it will become more easy because I'm already having a lot of email automation in my system and I would be able to identify yeah this is for this audience so that's why I give the same name this is the name of my subscription form you can make it unchecked if you are from European countries then you have to make it enable because in European countries they have a regulations of protecting data of the user but I'm from India though so I don't need to check this out I'm just going to leave it as it is I will click on next and here I'm going to design my email subscription form as per my offer as per my league magnet as you can see sending blue give you a pre-made newsletter email subscription form if you find this subscription form compatible with your brand or with your offer you can go with that but I'm not going to use this because my target audience is different I want to add my brand colors my brand elements so I'm going to design as per my audience as per my brand I don't need this newsletter text titles I will just remove whatever I don't need just remove that here you can find a bunch of options to customize your email subscription form like if you want a header you can simply drag and you can give whatever name you just want but in my case I don't want this header if you want to add some text you can do that as well if you want to add if you want to change the this font of the text you can do that if you want to give underline if you want to give a bold that's all you can do if you want to make it in center you, you can do it's fully customizable as per your font of your company of your uh, of your website you can have to design this if you want the image on this you can do this simply drag and you can upload your image from here from your gallery I'm going to use this element because this is going to be with my brand so I will use this and if you if you do any customization in the layout like if you don't like this layout you can do changes in that here from here you can go for horizontal in this way as you can see this box would come here if you go for a like if you go for a vertical it will come down you can able to change the size you can have a small one you can have a large one you can have a medium one so you can have any content layout it's all up to you. I'm going with the large one from here you can set the able to set the color of the content like if you don't want you can simply change the color but make sure that this color is compatible with your brand you can use only your brand color so my brand color is this so uh, this 
this this is my brand color so I'm going to keep that if you don't know what is your brand color you have to install this Chrome extension into your browser color Zilla and it and it will give you the color hexa code which you can simply paste and start the designing so like here and if you want to give a space you have this divider so you can able to add this space and you can able to add in the form of dot ed you can able to have in a dash you can able to increase the size or decrease the size so I don't need this one I will simply remove that and once you scroll down you will find there are other options which you can use it for designing your email subscription form as you can see there is only one field required like email I want one more attribute I want to take the name so what I can do I can simply drag this attribute above this and from here I don't want to take their phone number I want their first name so from here you have an option you want to take your phone number last name first name it's all up to you but in my case I want their first name and if you want in multiple line or your single I just want to keep at a single line because this looks good and if you want to remove this upper text like label name you can just simply uncheck because I don't want that I don't want helping text as well for this one is also remove I, I just want in this way I want to add my image my brand image in this right here so I will just click on that you have option from here to upload that image so now I want to add an image right up here so I will simply click on this and from here I will select my image the image I want to put here as I have already designed an image for this size so I'm going to pick this one and I will simply drag and just put it here so this is the image which I want to display on my subscription form and I also want to display an image at the background of this form so for that and what I will do I will simply click here I will go on form design and from here you can upload a image or you can also add a color as per your branding so this is my primary color of my website of my brand so I'm going to build everything around this color so I'm going to add the background related to this color so for uploading an image I'm going to click on this and I will scroll all the way down and this is the image which I want to upload I will simply drag and just lift here so as you can see that our image is successfully uploaded at the background so this is how our subscription form is going to be look if someone's visit our this form there are some more options which you can use you, you can if you want to add some spacing upward or downward you can just simply drag and drop and you can use that if you want some alerts like if someone's puts anything wrong this alert message will pop up if you want you can just add otherwise you can remove or if you want a button like if you want some extra button you can do that as you can see I have a button but I want to customize this button as per my brand so what I will do I just simply click here and I, I want to change the text of this color so what I can do I can simply change the text I want to type get now and I want to change the font also I want to use this font this looks good I want to change the color of the background I make it more dark simply drag and drop and now this good this looks good so as you can see this subscription forms matches my brand my website like I have this matching my color so everything is compatible with my brand so this is how you have to design your subscription for as for your brand as you can see I have a call to action here I have a call to action here I'm not asking too much detail because if you ask too many details in the subscription form there it is high chance that no no one's going to subscribe into your list the chances get decreased so it depends that what kind of things you are offering according to that you have to design your form I also want to change the color of this board as you can see it's right now it's white I want to change that so I will simply click on this container and I will scroll as you can see here is the option of color I will simply I will simply type the code and it will automatically change the color or if I want to add any paddings or that's all I can do so this is full customizable you have to play around these settings and this is my final subscription form is looking if this is how it's going to be look on the desktop if you want to see how it will look on phone you just simply click here and this is how it's going to look on mobile phone so you can do further customization just just simply play around as per your target audience as per your data collection that what are the details you want to take from them 
once you are satisfied once you are done with the designing part just simply click next as you can see you are getting this notification on the top bar send in blue recommending you to use this feature in your subscription form because there are a lot of votes on the internet so for preventing them to get into your subscriber list to prevent the bots you have to use this feature but i don't recommend you to use this because it decreases the chance of subscription so just leave it don't include in your subscription form and if you scroll it down and from here you have to select your email list you must remember in the last video i taught you that how you can import your contact in send in blue and how you can create your email list how you can create a list in this send in blue account so i am going to use the same list because here my target audience is those people who are interested in muscle care so i'm going to collect all the data those people who will subscribe to my email list through this form they're going to be in that folder muscle gain diet plan so i'm going to keep that all data in that folder so i will just simply select this and i will scroll it down and i will click on next and from here you have to do some important setting in your subscription forms and this is the most important part of your subscription form so do have to do it just do it the way i'm doing it and the way i'm telling you so let me tell you what does it mean double confirmation email means when someone subscribe to your email list through this form they will get an email into their email address and they have to verify the email then they will add to your list if they don't verify their email address then they will not get into your email list so they have to first verify then they will add in your email list just here we're not going to use any default template we're going to build a new templates i will teach you how you can build that i want that when someone subscribe to my email list they don't get any email verification so i will simply select this no confirmation email what it does that they don't need to verify they will simply put their name and email address and they will sign up into my email list so once you are done with the setting you have to simply click on next and from here you have to customize the messages which you want to show and when someone successfully subscribe to your account what message you want to display when someone's put in valid information what message you want to display when something error happen what message you want to display when someone leave empty box what message you want to do you want to display so it's fully customizable just play around it and try to include call to action in this once you're done with that just simply click next once you're done with all these important settings now here you would get the option that how you want to use this form like if you have a website or if you want to embed this form into a website you can simply copy this entire code and just paste into your header section of your website they provide you three options you can pick iframe you can pitch html you can simple html just simply copy the entire code and paste wherever you want if you don't want to paste in your website you can use the landing page of send it blue but for that you have to upgrade your account but so i must recommend you to paste this into your website header and it will display there and when someone come to their website they can easily subscribe to email list by filling, filling this details and if you want to see that how your subscription form will look you have to simply copy this entire code open a new tab and just simply paste and hit enter as you can see this is how your subscription form is going to look in the browser so you can do one you can simply copy this entire url and run the ad campaign when someone's come to this page they can easily put their name and email address and they subscribe into your email list so let me show you that how someone gets subscribed into your email list and where you will find that email so i'm going to show you that suppose i'm a visitor and i want to get this free muscle gain diet book so what i can do i can simply type my name send i will give the email id and i will click on get now as you can see i am successfully subscribed to the email list so as you can see that i have successfully subscribed to the email list so let me show you that where that email would be displayed so let me go back go let me go back to the contact contact and contact let me pick the contact and let me pick the folder the list which i have taken i took this one muscle gain diet plan and as you can see this is the email i have registered through the subscription form and i am added to this list muscle gain diet plan 
Dalit Hussain, email ID. So this is how you can design this subscription form in Send in Blue. It's very easy. But remember one thing when you start designing your subscription form, try to make it compatible with your brand with all the color scheme. Include more call to action. As you can see, I have included, I want to gain muscle diet. So this type of call to action you have to include your, in your subscription form. And that's it for this tutorial. In the next video, I'm going to teach you that how you can design your email template. So when someone added to your email list, they will get a message in their email in that we will provide them a free diet book for muscle building and we're going to provide some more information about our brand about what we do about and some other things that's all i'm going to cover in the next video where i will teach you that how you can design this template which help you to generate leads to nurture them and convert them into your clients no matter what and goal you have that's all i'm going to teach you in the next video where i will teach you that how you can design the email template in send in blue so don't forget to watch this video if you like this video give a thumbs up and like and if you want to know anything else about this video please do let me know i'll try to help you out so bye bye see you in the next video